Hey everyone, Rodev here, and in today's video, I'm going to be showing you guys how to create a game pass that gives your uh, players a certain tool in your game. So that can be a gun, a bat, um, you know, a water balloon, really anything, and that tool can be given to the players if they own the game pass. And the players will keep this tool after they die. So let's get right into it. So if you don't have a game pass already, what we can do is uh, click on the I card in the top right of the video right now. And with that I card, you can go ahead and make your own game pass and come back to this video. From here, once you have your game pass made, you can actually click on it and you'll be taken to the uh, game pass page. From there, you want to go to the top and double click these numbers right here and copy them. Once you have them copied, you can go to Roblox Studio. Alright guys, once you are in Roblox Studio, the first thing you want to do is uh, put your tool in server storage. So if it's in starter pack, take it out and put it in server storage. And once you have it here, you want to go to server script service, create a new script. Make sure it's a script and not a local script or a module script. Make sure it's a normal script. Once you have the script, you want to open it up and type all of this code out. So uh, real quick, I'm going to explain all of the code. So right here, we get a variable for server storage. And then right here, we get our tool. So make sure the name of the tool is put right over here exactly how it is. And then after that, we get a variable for marketplace service. And then we get a variable for player service. And with that, what we do is we use the player added event for when a player joins the game. And then after that, we check if they own the game pass. And if they don't own the game pass, then what we do is we actually wait until they, uh, or we're not even wait, we just um, pause the script until their backpack and starter gear is loaded, if they do own the game pass by the way. Then we'll clone the tool and give it to them, and this will ensure that they get the tool and it stays in the inventory even after they die. And uh, real quick, I'm going to be showing you guys how to make it so if they don't own the tool, we can actually prompt them to buy it. So down here what we can do is MPS colon prompt uh, product purchase or prompt game pass purchase and then what we can do is pass in the player instance and then paste in your game pass id and right here if they don't own the tool it's going to prompt on their screen to purchase the game pass and then uh, once they purchase the game pass all you have to do is tell them to rejoin the game and all of this code up here is going to run and they will receive their tool so now if we hit play as you can see i spawn in and my tool is given to me and uh, with this pistol even if i die i will still keep it so if I reset character and I respawn, I still have my tool. This script is actually an issue from the actual tool itself, but your tool probably won't have any errors. But other than that guys, that's how you create a game pass that gives you the tool uh, when you join the game, and it will uh, allow you to keep the tool even after you die. But other than that guys, if this video did help you, please be sure to leave a like and subscribe so I know it helped you, and I'll continue to make really cool content like this in the future. But other than that guys, uh, yeah, make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace.